Colin Ingram leads Glamorgan Resistance with a battling 71 not out. It was Grenada to Glamorgan for England opener Alex Lees, who was back in the whites of Durham as his side travelled to Sophia Gardens, Cardiff, to take on a Glamorgan side boosted by the return of overseas players Colin Ingram and Michael Nisa, as well as the new signing of batter Sam Northeast. Durham won the toss and elected to bowl, and were rewarded with the first wicket of the county summer, as Andrew Salter was comprehensively bowled by Matty Potts for one, the ball seeming back in from a length. David Lloyd was joined at the crease by Ingram, and they took the score to 54 for one before Lloyd fell to Ben Rain as he was comfortably caught by David Beddingham in the slips. That wicket brought a new signing northeast to the crease, who combined with Ingram to take Glamorgan past 100 without further loss. Ingram bringing up his 50 and the team's three figures with three boundaries in one pots over. However, Northeast fell in the following over for 24 to the bowling of Chris Rushworth. Northeast had edged his previous delivery for four, but Rushworth got his man with a ball that nipped away and struck the batter on the back leg. A new batter, Kieran Carlson, didn't fare much better. Clean bowled by Ben Rain to leave Glamorgan 107 for four at lunch, with Ingram unbeaten on 53. Chris Cook joined Ingram at the crease, and despite surviving an early scare, the wicketkeeper began to rebuild well with Ingram at the other end. Another Cook cut shot took Glamorgan past 150, only for a hailstorm to arrive and halt the Welsh side's progress and lead to an early tea break being taken. Ingram on 61 and Cook on 29, with Ben Rain the pick of the bowlers with 2 for 23. After the break, Ingram added another two boundaries to take the partnership past 50. But unfortunately, the rain didn't relent, meaning on day one, the Morgan finished on 164 for four, with honours even heading into day two.